ओके गाइस इट्स मी इमात फ्रॉम नेल्सन डार्विन पार्क टेक यूट्यूब चैनल सो टुडे इन दिस वीडियो ट्यूटोरियल वी विल लर्न अबाउट हाउ टू डिक्लेयर ए ग्लोबल वेरिएबल विद इन दी जावा एक्लिप्स आई सो हाउ वी कैन डू दैट बट बिफोर गोइंग टू दैट थिंग यू फर्स्ट यू मस्ट नो दैट देर इज एंट एनी सॉर्ट ऑफ ग्लोबल डिक्लेरेशन इन साइड दी जावा इट इज नॉट लाइक सी आर some embedded c thing okay so there is a little because it is an object oriented programming so there is a little different procedure in order to like uh, declare a variable as global so how we can do that first you need to click on create a new java project write global 1 or global 0 and click on next and then finish this is the name of the project now we will expand the expand the project we need to right click on src folder we will go to new and then on class we can write anything any name of our class that is global underscore four and we also need to take the public static void main string and or and all this thing because it create a void main function for us So now our coding environment has been created. Now we can see that we have our uh, one public class which is called as global underscore four, and there is void main function. So main uh, we we all need to put all sort because main function is our main function through which we can call certain other functions. Okay, so. how we can do that okay first you must know that we can like uh, if if you want to declare a global variable can we write can we write above the class we we cannot okay just like you can see that if we want to write this int y on the top it is not going to work if if we write static int y okay still it is not allowed inside inside the java so what we maximum can is to always write inside the body of the class so here we will write static int y so now what is this thing static is a keyword which is used for to for to force this variable y to behave globally so that all sort of things all sort of methods functions which are inside this class global underscore four can use this can use the value of this y okay or or can use this variable y okay just like here uh, can can i write in in void main can we write okay now system sorry system dot out dot print print ln and why now either because it is static int okay so now now can we see that either we can print it out or not so yeah yeah it is printing it is zero okay it is it is zero so here we can even assign the value of y is equal to 3 so uh, now we, we will see either it is going to work yeah still it is in although it is inside void main function still it is working okay now uh, we can go for certain other uh, okay we will make certain other pro function so we will write static func okay and this is our function okay this is our static void okay void means the return type is nothing so static func so here we will write can can we do this thing system dot print l and y and here y is equal to like uh, seven so either it is going to work or not okay yeah it it is not giving error but but as it is static void func so we need to call it inside the void main function so whenever we will write func the control will go to func that is the our user defined function and execute all these statements so because it is not going to execute on its own you have to write the name of the function and these parentheses in the void main function 
so right click okay now run it out and it is three and seven three and seven okay it means that now this is global declar declaration okay it's, it's not perfect but a type of global declaration inside the java so hopefully you got the concept so thanks for visiting our channel and don't forget to subscribe